your latest news update from Western Mass News. Good Monday afternoon. I'm Chris Pisano with a look at your headlines. Concerning situation for nine Springfield residents when heavy rain yesterday caused their apartments to flood. The fire department responded to this Springfield Gardens apartment building a little before 11 a.m. yesterday. Residents were evacuated as water was pouring into several apartments. Officials determining the cause was a clogged drain on the roof. In Ludlow, a tractor trailer overturned at the entrance area to the Ludlow Mass Pike exit heading eastbound this morning. This was the scene when our crews first arrived. Mass State Police say the call originally came in around 745. They tell us the driver of the truck didn't need to be transported to the hospital. No word on when the crash will be cleared. Plans to develop a new retail development are in the works in Palmer. As residents continue to push to add a new train stop in town, part of the highly anticipated east-west rail. The rail would connect Pittsfield to Boston via a high-speed train with stops along the way in Chester, Springfield, Palmer, Worcester, and Boston. Supporters say it would benefit the town and the region. The new mixed retail development is being planned for property on Thorndike Street along Route 32. I'm meteorologist Jana Brown with a check of your forecast. We'll keep scattered cloud cover throughout the rest of the night. Some partial clearing from time to time. Not expecting to see the northern lights this time around. We kind of missed the big storm last night, unfortunately. Temperatures down to the middle 30s and wind becomes light to calm. Now for tomorrow, we're going to start the day off with some sunshine, but then we'll cloud back up for the afternoon. A couple of spotty showers are possible, but a few downpours, a rumble of thunder, even some grapple or small hail could be seen with some of those showers moving through. Highs will be in the middle to upper 50s with a healthy breeze out of the northwest. The next several days remain a bit unsettled. Wednesday, it looks like we'll have another round of showers for the afternoon and evening. Thursday is looking a little bit drier, partly cloudy with a high near 60. And then Friday, increasing clouds with highs in the middle 60s, getting the mildest that we'll see this week, which is actually temperatures at normal. So we get a bit of a break to end the week with wet weather. But by the weekend, we're tracking another storm, which could bring another round of heavy rain. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.